Happy birthday, Mike Chavanez. Best campus minister who ever lived. Well, it'll probably be at least a few days before I get this video online. It's hard to find the time to edit, and then on top of that, I have to find a Wi Fi connection with enough bandwidth to be able to upload a video. And so far, I've only got my first video this week. The day I first set out on the road up, up, up. Wait, no, not even that one. The day before I first got on the road is the only video I've uploaded from this week so far. We're about to get on the Pennsylvania Turnpike. Take this load to Bedford. This is a really heavy load. I just had to slide my tandems for the first time. Drive axle weight is now just barely under the legal limit of 34,000 pounds. Drop this load in Bedford and head about an hour or so north of Bedford to Tipton and pick up a load of, I believe it's. Glass that's going to be used for building cars and deliver that to Chrysler in Detroit. We'll get that there tomorrow morning. Pretty hard trying to stay on schedule, but I think for a rookie I'm doing okay. We are on I-99, headed to a glass factory in Tipton, Pennsylvania, about a half hour from here. Dropped our last load at a Walmart warehouse. It took a little bit longer than I would have hoped to get out of there, but I'm still doing okay. I think this next load of glass for car windows is supposed to be slightly less heavy than the load I just took this morning. I hope it is, because I really don't want to have to slide my tandems again. I'm already behind as it is. We're getting loaded now, as you can tell by the shaking of the truck. We are in Blair County, which we drove through yesterday, and now I've visited it for the first time. While uh, they're loading me, I need to plan out the rest of this trip, figure out how long it's going to take me to get to Detroit and where I'm going to stop for the night. This will be my first night this week, probably stopping at a truck stop or rest area for the night. So I'll need to make sure that I get off the road early enough to find a place before all the parking is full. And if I have time left after that, well, they're still loading me after I finish trip planning, I'll get, hopefully get caught up on editing videos from the last couple days. We picked up our next load. We're on our way to get on IA. We'll be heading back up in the same direction that we headed for our first load. Probably stopping for the night somewhere around Cleveland again. We're going to Detroit in the morning. I would like to go further, but we go much further beyond Cleveland, we probably would have a hard time finding parking for the night. We're on I-80 again. I just made a stop in Clearfield County to scale this load. Excellence would go on this one, didn't have to slide the tandems. So it should be able to make slight 
this whole thing that I have no control over what loans I get assigned. Just thankful that I'm getting to do something I love for a living now. Not that I didn't love doing ministry work. I just wasn't finding the satisfaction that I needed from that work. Like, I enjoyed that I was trying to bring God into people's hearts. But I just didn't have the skills or the personality to do a really good job of it, like my co-workers in the past year did. going to accomplish in terms of evangelization. But I know God will be pleased that I'm just trying to do my part to spread the gospel in a way that is suited to my unique talents that he gave me. We're parked for the night at Flying J in Hubbard, Ohio, just west of the state line. I was hoping I'd get to go a little further today, but because Schneider requires me to avoid the Ohio Turnpike at all costs, there wouldn't have been many other places I could have stopped along my route tonight before I ran out of hours, and I wouldn't have known where they were without stopping to go online and look them up. And the Wi-Fi here does not have enough bandwidth for me to upload videos, so... And, and depending on where I stop the next few days, I might not be able to upload any videos until next week. Hope I can upload them as soon as I can. Because I don't want to leave you all hanging, but it is what it is. If it becomes a persistent problem, I might cave and get a bigger data plan. I have to be up at 4 a.m. tomorrow morning. And that's when I have to start. That's when I have to start driving. So, before that, I'm gonna go to that Waffle House right over there and have breakfast. Normally, I just have something really quick an English muffin with peanut butter, banana, granola bar. But today, I did not have a hot meal, so. We'll take care of that tomorrow, first thing. I try to do a little video editing before bed, but I can't stay up too late because of how early I have to be up. Until next time, please keep me in your prayers and I'll keep you in mind. God bless.